What's going on everybody and welcome back to the channel now. Tonight we've got the Tartars or Tartar Tatters Business Empire in brackets 100 countries Ratan Tartar. I imagine that's the guy's name. How big is Tartar? Now I actually don't even know what fucking Tartar is. So we're going to check the description right now. I had about a lot of people DM this to me and a lot of people uh um, yeah, a lot of people DM'd it to me, a lot of people told me to react to it, so I'm assuming that no one's let me down and made me react to some shit. Um, what is it? I mean, obviously it's a business of some sort. Tata owned Jaguar, Range Rover, Tetley, TCS. Oh, so they own like car company. They So they're a company that owns other companies is what I'm grasping from that. But hey, remember if you are new, leave a like, subscribe right now and comment down below. What should you comment? We'll get, we'll, we'll figure that out at the end of the fucking video, but hey, let's check it out. Also, if you do have a video you would like to request that is obviously not copyright of any sort, then follow me on Instagram or Twitter, whichever one you prefer, all is in the description and all that. Um, and yeah, follow me and DM it through there, it's a lot easier, trust me. Let's check it out. Let's go. What the fuck is this sexy Bombay music? House. This is a simple looking head office of the Tata Group. I got subtitles on because... Look, but Tata um, Group is anything. I like to read. Simple. Started as a small trading company by Jamshed Ji Tata in 1868. 1868? That was like a couple of years ago. Than Toyota. They own Toyota, Coke, Coke, Facebook, Microsoft, and Google. Oh, they have more employees. It Never now mind. Operates in over 100 countries. Mm-hmm. Is it in so Australia? I'd say so. And take a world tour to witness the remarkable business empire of Tata Group. Tata. It is Tata. Good. Our first stop is North America. Here Tata Group owns the luxury hotel Taj Campton Palace. They own this? Francisco. Do they own this? Taj Boston. Okay. And one of the world's finest and New York's iconic hotel, The Pierre. The Pierre. Tata's Tetley Tea. Oh! Tea we drink that! Uh, oh, I don't drink tea. I'm a coffee man, but I do know of the Tetley tea. So that's that's US what's up. And largest in Canada, they also own popular brands like Good Earth. Okay. And America's third largest coffee company, Eight O'Clock Coffee. I don't live in America, so Canada's I don't know. IT sales yeah, company TCS operates 24 offices in North America. Shit. And while their animation and design lab, Tata Elixir, also operates in eight that's plus locations jazz in the background. In the region. In the manufacturing sector, the group operates a soda ash mining company in Wyoming, <laughs> iron ore mining company in, in Quebec, Quebec, Canada, steel manufacturing facilities in Ohio and Pennsylvania, yeah. and also a coffee production plant. In all, Tata Group employs over 20,000 people in Damn. North America. Damn! Well, if you want a job, go to fucking Tata! Then how many people Microsoft employs in Shit. India? Shit! Now let's travel to South America. PCS employs more than 8,000 people in 8 countries in South America. Yeah. The group is also an investor in the first submarine fiber cable network between US and Brazil. Tata has also own world's largest subsea fiber cable network. How the hell do you get cords underwater? percent of world's internet routes like, wouldn't, travel wouldn't over. cords, like if water goes into the cords and stuff, wouldn't it like just malfunction? Seems fishy. And that was a that was a C pun if you got that one. Tata's <laughs> subsea network. Oh, dad joke. From God. South America. Disappointed Let's myself for that one. Africa that was bad. And land in the port city of South Africa, Cape Town. Here, is that Cape Tata Town? Group owns the historic luxury hotel. See, I know Cape Taj Town from Cape cricket. Town. We know what happened in, in Cape Town with Australia. Let's not talk about that. Taj Pamodzi, one of the most luxurious hotels of the country. Tata's also operate two wind farms in South Africa a wind and a hydroelectric power project in Zambia. Zambia? That's a weird place to get Tocles, businesses. South Africa's third largest tea company. Tata Trucks and Buses are one of the top sellers in Zambia, South Africa and Kenya. Kenya? In manufacturing sector, Tata owns a chemical plant in Magadi, Kenya, which is Africa's largest soda ash manufacturer. Commercial they drink soda in Kenya? and a steel plant in South Africa and finally a manufacturing and a power plant in Mozambique. Mozambique. From Mozambique we will move to London. Here we go. Buckingham Palace. Hey! Official residence. 
close to the palace, Tatas own the luxurious Taj 51 Buckingham Gate Suites. Really? The hotel also has the Damn, that's a nice fire. Jaguar Suite. Ah. Nearby, the St. James Court Hotel is also owned by the group. Okay. Tatas Tetley is the largest tea company in the UK. Obviously, that's all they fucking drink. That's if I was making a tea company, I'd be making sure I'm getting that shit into England because all they do, you know, the stereotype like, would you like a sip of tea with a biscuit or a scone? <laughs> that was the accent, people. Let me know in the comments. I reckon that was fucking Euro good. Let's not beat around the bush. That was good. White eggs. Okay, I know that. Grind in Poland. Jemka. Don't know that. Looks nice as Republic. hell, though. And Grind, a coffee brand. In Russia. What about Tata anything steel in Australia? Is one of Europe's largest steel maker, and TCS has been awarded as the best employer in Europe. Really? That's what's up. Jaguar Land Shout Rover out. is also owned by Tatas, and is the largest manufacturer of premium vehicles in Britain. The group also Fuck. operates design centers in London and Paris, and one of the world's Frankfurt. largest e-learning company in UK, Germany, and Switzerland. Yeah. Tata employs around 60,000 people in Europe 60, and is also UK's biggest industrial employer. To end it all, Tata's also own a relatively small company called British Salt. Damn, they own and everything! An Indian company Probably own a condom British factory Salt. as well, god Quite damn. ironic. If one remembers Gandhi's Salt March, carried out against the British Raj only 88 years ago. Now let's go hey! all the way to Sydney. Australia. Woo! Shit! Here in Sydney, TCS began its first operations in Australia. And now, the company operates across Melbourne Australia and New Zealand with over 10,000 nice. employees. Nice! And clients like Qantas, Telstra, hey! and Commonwealth Bank. Nice! That's what's up! Hey! I've probably been on a Qantas airplane before. I've been with Telstra. And I've been to a bank, and I know where the I mean, I know of the Commonwealth Bank, so that's it. Tata's also own popular Australian coffee machine. Nah, that's what I don't Nash. drink that. And operate data centers I drink, across uh, Australia different brand. through their partnership with Next DC. I don't know the what the fuck that is. The group also holds stake in Carborough Downs Coal Project in Queensland, Australia. Finally, we have reached Asia. Is that fucking Let's it? Start. Is that all you do in Australia? In the desert sands. Damn, I was of kind of Middle expecting East. a bit more from Tata you. Tata <laughs> is one of the most sought after four wheel drives in the region. Tata Motors is also a leader in the medium and heavy commercial vehicle segment in GCC countries. While TCS has multiple offices in the Middle East, including an all women IT services is center. Is that uh, Donald Trump's wife? What the hell is she doing? This, this, this fucking bitch right here. The hell is she doing? What's her name? Melania? Or is that the daughter? Tia no, that's a porn star. Tiana's a porn star. Um I don't know I don't know what her name is. I think it's Melana or some fucking weird shit. Riyadh, Saudi Arabia. The She's a racist! Titan. She she married a racist and you wanna to go to a, a country like that? You're lucky you made it out alive, not even gonna cap. Our leading brand. <laughs> In Oman. Oh, do they make Titan watches? They also that's own awesome. logistics company. I love Titan watches, so that's cool. And the luxurious city hotel Taj Dubai, near popular landmarks like Palm Jumeirah. Finally, Voltas. Voltas. Voltas leading air conditioning brand has completed major mechanical and air conditioning projects that include Burj Khalifa, Dubai. The Burj Khalifa, really? Airports in UAE and Bahrain, Ferrari Experience. And F1 race track what the fuck in is Abu Dhabi, Southeast Asia. From deserts of UAE, we will move to South Korea. Here, Tata owns South Korea's second largest heavy commercial vehicle manufacturer, Daewoo. Tata Daewoo. Okay. In Singapore, Tata Steel Plant is the largest single cut and bend steel operations worldwide. That's in Australia Daewoo as well. Nat Steel, also the largest probably. producer of long steel products in Thailand. Tata's also own stake in oil and gas blocks mm. and coal reserves in Indonesia and are developing power generation steak. projects. So what I'm going to say real quick is that I've noticed that they don't, of, of all the stakes, like they've owned like 6% in that, 30% in that, 20% in that, 15% in that. So it's clearly they give a lot of the stakeholder and they, they, they own a good amount of a lot of things so they can accumulate a lot of money. 
but then they they give a lot of the money back, which I clearly Myanmar is what I'm trying to notice. Vietnam, and even operate a life. I mean, do they donate some of the money? Maybe I mean I don't know because they would make so Singapore fucking much of it. And Indonesia, even Tata's Voltas has executed engineering projects like New Hong Kong International Airport. And Cyberport business. Damn, Park Hong Kong really Hong is Kong. in the future. I mean, Hong China. Kong looks like it's in the year two thousand three hundred. PCS has six global delivery centers. Tata's own two rolling mills. Green tea. A refractories factory. An auto parts factory. Green tea. Yay! Plant, and also have a Jaguar Land Rover assembly yeah. plant. We have reached South Asia, the beautiful and scenic Maldives. I didn't know they Maybe had shops at the Maldives. Taj Coral Reef, oh. with white sands and scenic Damn. view. Damn! Moving ahead to Sri Lanka, Taj owns. I want to go to the fucking Maldives so bad. <laughs> Look how beautiful! Like the Maldives almost makes me horny. Like <laughs> no joke. Like, look at that. Imagine just going there to your own island. That, that is, I want to be able to wake up, jump out of the house into clean, fresh, beautiful, clear water. Moving ahead to Sri Lanka. So cool. The picture is Cost probably a lot of money to go there, but one day. In Colombo, Tata's Sri Lanka. also provide telecommunication services Nepal. in Nepal and Sri Lanka. And have even deployed a hydro project in Bhutan. Where the After hell is Bhutan? Long world tour, we have finally reached. Hey! TCS is the largest Indian company. TCS becomes the first Indian company to hit a hundred billion dollars in market cap. One hundred billion dollars? What the hell? Is a leader Damn. in commercial vehicles segment. Okay. The company is India's largest manufacturer yeah. of branded watches. Facts. Tata is also They're nice. The largest jewelry store chain, Tanishq. While their Tanish. Tata Power is India's largest integrated power company, Tata's also own steel plants, steel plantations, automobile manufacturing units, chemical factories, and even own mobile networks and DTH company Tata Sky. Tata Not Sky. Only that, they operate airline Vistara and also manufacture defense helicopters and equipments. Damn, this beat in the background Even is Starbucks just... in India They have a 50% stakes of Starbucks in India? By the Tata. Shit, Tata they would be making a shitload. A massive a sh empire. But also shit load. <laughs> social institutions oh. like cancer treatment centers, oh, that's what's up. mathematics and science research institutes. That's what's up. They, did that say they own a cancer treatment center? If that's, if that's what it said, that's what's up. I respect, a lot of and respect. Also, the first to that. planned industrial city of India, Jamshedpur. 66% of the group shares are held by a charity. Oh, I thought so. Day. See, I said that before. I wonder if they donate a lot of it to like charity, which 66%. Tell me another company in the world that does that. Damn, really, 66%. That just one proves how much money they're making. Two, it proves that they have good people who run the business and they're not cold hearted money fucking extorting dogs. They're people who genuinely care about the world. So respect. The company has been involved respect to Tata, in you've earned a lot of my programs. respect. Tata is truly an incredible company and has traveled yeah. a long way from Mumbai to be now present all across the world. Respect all a I lot. Can say is, this is Tata's business. Okay. Empire. Hey guys, that is gonna cap it off Tata's business empire in a hundred countries. It's a huge place. I didn't know they owned all that. I didn't know they were in a hundred countries. Um, and as I said, I, I assumed with all that money they would have donated, but 66% into certain charities is incredible. They have a cancer treatment research of some sort, or they hold a stake in one, or own of some sort. That's incredible. So clearly one of the better businesses out there in the world. Uh, but hey, that is gonna cap it off, guys. Remember, if you are new, subscribe. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.